Hi friends, this is our 16 bit calculator. This is 7 segment display. This is microcontroller. This is max 7 to 19 integrated circuit. And rest part is the keypad matrix and jumper wires. This is our test circuit. This is our decimal result and this is our binary result. So where we are getting mistakes or where we are doing mistakes or some difficulties and what actually we are suffering into the coding. Uh, find out that difficulties or troubleshooting the same we prepared this kind of the test circuit so we can understand where we are going wrong actually so what happened actually over here when i pressing 999 so this is binary 999 it is okay and this is decimal 999 this is also okay but when i press more 9 one more 9 so decimal 199 is wrong while this binary uh, 4 times 9 this 9999 is correct so we uh, can understand where we are actually getting uh, difficulties or uh, where we are doing mistake program for our calculator and we can uh, then troubleshoot this difficulty 1111 So this is binary output and this is decimal okay for better understanding of this breadboard calculator we must understand logic behind this calculator or programming what actually we are doing for this calculator you know that we are scanning our 16 keys continuously as soon as we press the key that key will read by dedicated pin register we are seeing general purpose register and arithmetic logic unit as well as SPI circuitry in the architecture this is port A circuitry and output pins for port A we are using this port for higher byte of data this E represents the addition on our breadboard calculator. Now we are performing addition. As soon as we press the key, that key we stored in one of the general purpose register which we have selected. For example, we press the key 2. Then we load that key with the instruction load immediate 2 into that particular register which we have selected immediately we transfer that value in our case 2 into the RAM location of our choice ok now we are seeing the subtraction indication for our calculator and we are performing subtraction on our breadboard calculator for every next key press we refresh our register value all this we are doing for our first part of calculation then we press plus minus multiplication or division key when we press this key we set bit of a register of our choice after this we will move to the second part of our calculation now we will select one another register among the general purpose register for our next part of the calculation this is multiplication sign for our calculation and now we are performing multiplication on this breadboard calculator now we successfully stored our two part of calculation in two different register now we will press the equal key if bit in the register is set for multiplication our microcontroller perform accordingly this is the division sign of our calculator and we are performing division on our breadboard calculator 
for multiplication we use the mul instruction but for division we don't have any such instruction so we subtract multiple time divisor from dividend our calculator limit is 16 bit that is f f f f in hex and 65535 in decimal we have initialized spi in master mode we refresh the data register of spi every time we refresh the register for our key values and result we will see sign number calculation and more than 16 bit number calculation in coming episode and fractional number also thank you for your valuable time